time it's like five o'clock right now I got about three hours and I'm uh, taking the video with this Acaso V50 some summer endless summer edition so I'm trying out the new camera and I'm at the little channel catfish hole right here as you can see so before I begin let me show y'all what I'll be using today here, I'm just using two rods, two fr my freshwater rods, right here. These two simple spin casters, about say 15 pound, uh, I think mono, and a uh, cork and a uh, two turn hook with a slip shot. So that's all I'm using today. Something simple. You know, first we gotta catch the bait. If we go catch a uh, catfish, so. I'm going to go ahead and got some red wigglers, going to put them on my line, I got crickets, I'm going to throw them on my line and see if we get some of these small little uh, brim out of here and use them for the catfish. So stay tuned. Catfish. It's gonna be warm. All right, got one. Got a nice fish right here. Nice old brim right here. See, right there. All right, got another one. Got another one. There you go. Got here, little guy. Right, my hook. Oh, we got. Uh, I thought it was a nice one. It may be a nice one. Right there. Another small little guy. Need to put a bigger hook on here. What a wonderful morning today. I'm here in the uh, Brunswick area again. I didn't want to go too far this time. Just want to stay a little close to home. So, uh, yep, I got going with three rods today. And uh, I got some mud minnows and some uh, dead shrimp. So I'm gonna go ahead, go ahead and uh, try for some uh, trout today as a flounder. So I saw the guy catch flounder and trout out here. So I came back to where Greg and I were last week and uh, see if I can get on some trout and some flounder today. If not, we'll go to uh, St. Simon's Pier and try there later on. I'm gonna stay here till around 12 o'clock then uh, head somewhere else if I'm not catching. So we'll see what we get, stay tuned. And I'll also explain uh, all the gear that I'm using today. All right, later. All right, first fish of the day. Oh, cut a crab on the hook. I was expecting that. Nice 
last trout right here. That's something on here. Stingray. Let y'all know what I'm catching these whiting on. I'm using the top bottom rigs made by Hurricane from Walmart. This comes with already made. All you do is add a, a pyramid sinker or any sinker that you want. So that's what I'm using for these whiting. And just using shrimp. And uh, here's the pyramid sinker. I usually use three or two. And just put some shrimp, dead shrimp on it and let it sit at the bottom. So here's that again. There you go. This is what it looks like. What they look like on the line. Got the hook. Got another hook. We got this pretty sink at the bottom. Yeah. Oh, this is dried up. Got a pretty nice size. This is crab bait. This is croaker. Jeez. 
back once I get them up if I get them up St. Simons, but as you can see, it's too crowded up at this pier here. So I'm gonna go ahead, head back to the house. Chino, we up here in a undisclosed location. About to get on these fish right here. See what we get. Stay tuned. Let's see what we got. Getting a good fight, man. A spot. spot. I'm gonna show it to the, to the little guard disposal. Little garbage disposal right here. There he goes. That pinfish? Yeah. Nah. Maybe it's not. Damn. Oh, don't go that way. 